this is your boy Deontay Nelson in today's video will be another YouTube news topic video if you haven't already make sure you check out the description I'm doing an iPhone 7 giveaway all you gotta do to enter this giveaway is subscribe to the channel um, hit that bell to write the subscribe button follow me on Twitter in the bottom left hand corner of your screen stay active on the channel and you have a chance to win an iPhone 7 but into the video for today first topic comes from Lance Stewart and Jake Paul now Apparently they're having some beef right now because Lance Stewart um, actually tweeted out this picture that you see on your screen right now showing that um, Jake Paul actually blocked him on Twitter. Now he didn't leave this tweet up for very long. He actually took it down relatively fast. But a lot of people were just really questioning why, he, um, like what was going on between the two because why would Jake Paul just randomly block Lance Stewart? Well... It has been known that Lance Stewart is actually starting his own um, team. Basically, he's calling it 210 Official. He's buying a house. So a lot of people are saying that Jake Paul is getting upset because Lance Stewart is copying him and buying a house and starting this kind of team and all this stuff. And I can understand why Jake Paul is getting upset. I mean, but Lance Stewart also has the right to start his own team. So... I mean, I just, I'm really interested to see what, or hear what actually takes place with this situation over the next couple of days, because, like, I mean, there's got to be more to the story than what we know right now, because no one's going to block someone just because they're starting their own team. But into the next topic of today, we have one from Black Badge. Um, this dude is a police officer. Um, who streams while he is um, on duty. He basically just streams um, on Twitch and on YouTube, and he just shows, like, everyone, um, like, the life of a cop, I guess. And he's been growing pretty, pretty fast, because, I mean, that is an interesting um, avenue to show, because, I mean, he is, like, he, he, I mean, there's not a lot of cops that stream on YouTube or Twitch, so, I mean, he's been gaining a lot of followers quick, but it came out the other day that he actually said the N-word on stream. I could not get it downloaded, um, the, the video clip downloaded to show y'all, but he did, in fact, say the N-word. And, I mean, that's just scary because he is a cop and he is streaming on YouTube and he's still saying the N-word. Like, I mean, like, it's nothing. And, um, it's just foolery, like... I mean, I don't know why people want to use the N-word, and I mean, I just don't understand, because now this guy can possibly lose his job if someone reports it to local his local police officer, uh, police department. He could lose his job and over some foolery, and uh, he, probably, he probably isn't even racist, but the fact that he said it, he could get in trouble, so it just shows you that you got to watch what you say, especially when you're streaming you're big on a big like social media platform but this last topic comes from Daz a youtuber named Daz he was actually at McDonald's a couple uh, well, a couple nights ago and he actually got robbed um, what happened was a couple guys came into the McDonald's where he was at and he had like a really nice watch on and nice clothing on and they wanted him to give them the watch and Basically, they were harassing him, and he had a bag in his hand, and he left the bag in McDonald's and then proceeded to leave McDonald's because he was being harassed. He came back to get his bag, and someone had took it. So, I mean, he had a bunch of important stuff like his passport and different things in that bag. So that is a bummer because, I mean, someone took it, and they're not going to give it back to him. So that is a bummer. But um, thank you all for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Twitter. It's been your boy Deontay Nelson. I'm out. Peace.